how do you prepare your uh, not sweet potatoes how do you prepare your potatoes the ones that i call irish potatoes so that um, your family members or whoever is coming to eat asks for more so welcome to my kitchen this is eileen sunday evening i'm back and um, ready to prepare a quick meal so that um, i can get ready for monday which is the beginning of the week so Today I decided to prepare Irish potatoes and um, for those of you who call the potatoes by a different name, these are the ones which I call Irish potatoes. Sometimes they are sold uh, as white potatoes or red potatoes and they are very different from the sweet potatoes. So I realized that um, if I boil the potatoes and serve them with uh, a protein and uh, vegetables, uh, people don't eat as much, or even me, I don't like them that way because uh, first of all, the color looking white, and then, you know, instead of just boiling them and using them, then I would rather bake them, which is what most people do. Uh, I try not to deep fry them, so instead of doing that, I have come up with innovative ways of uh, spicing up my potatoes, the Irish potatoes, I've come up with ways to spice them up, and um, as you can see, the sauce for my potatoes looks uh, colorful. So it's not uh, full of spice, but um, different ingredients. Of course, pepper is one of them. I also added turmeric. I think I have four different, five different types of um, spice and herbs, which I've ha added to the sauce, including tomatoes. And for this, um, for the potatoes, I decided to use the canned tomatoes. Partly because we are running out of the fresh ones, which we bought in the summer, so I keep alternating and choosing which meal will receive the canned tomatoes and which one will I use the frozen tomatoes. So what I'm going to do today is to add more color to the sweet potatoes not to the sweet potatoes, to the Irish potatoes. And the color which I'm going to add is from the beetroot, so beets. These are beets that we planted, I think it's um, last summer. So normally we harvest, prepare them and freeze them. So all that I did today was to boil them. And then after that, I chopped them into smaller pieces, partly because um, I'm not using a lot of um, the beetroot. It's just for color and for nutrition. Um, so that again, we can leave the potatoes to take their space in the cooking pot. So I'm going to add, I've already made the sauce, I'm going to add some of the beets. So for you, how do you eat your beetroot? Do you eat them raw? Do you add them to salad? Do you use them to color your food? How do you, you can comment below and let me know the different ways that you use your beetroot. Or how do you cook your Irish potatoes? Do you boil them? Do you bake them? Do you deep fry them? And uh, maybe you can share information on why you decide to cook them that way. So as I said, the sauce for the potatoes is ready. So next I'm going to add uh, 
So as you can see, I've done the initial work of uh, preparing them, getting them ready, and um, I washed them. So now I'm going to add them into the sauce. So this is uh, how I prepare the Irish potatoes. I don't boil and then fry them. I make the sauce and add them in so that as they cook, then they blend in with the sauce so that when you're eating, it's a... Uh, you don't taste the, the spices or the herbs which I added. That's why I prepare the sauce first. I let it simmer, then add the potatoes. And then after that, I'll let them um, cook. And today I'm going to serve them with a, a protein and vegetables. But I'm not preparing that because we have leftovers in the fridge. So I'm going to ask everybody to find their protein in the fridge because I've seen we have uh, beans, we have uh, chicken, we have some mushrooms from yesterday. So to help me start the week without a lot of leftovers, I'm going to ask people to to warm their vegetables and their protein. So yeah, I've added all the potatoes. Uh, so this is the soup from boiling the beetroot. I don't pour this, so I'm going to use it in the potatoes. So how did you spend your weekend? What did you do that is different from the other days? For me, today I went out for some physical exercise and it's actually making me feel very energetic at this time. I know tomorrow I'll be feeling even better. For you, what did you do that you did not do during the week? So now I'm going to cover, increase the heat and let the potatoes cook. Okay, so what did you have for dinner or what did you prepare for your lunch or for your breakfast? You can comment below and let me know if you have a question about um, the potatoes which I've just prepared. You can comment below and I'll uh, respond to that. Or if you would like to see the final a dish after they are cooked you can also ask for that and i'll uh, share a photo so as always this is a program for the woman who is uh, over 40 and lives in a city and they would like to make food choices which will help them lead a healthy life tomorrow next year or 40 50 years to come so if you are that type of woman you are over 40 you are welcome comment and share information on the choices the food choices that you're making to help you lead a better life so for now i'll stop here i know it's the